Hey guys. Um, okay, so there's a misunderstanding with the whole Gears of War 4 uh, Rockstar cans. Alright, uh, the display at Walmart, evidently I did not read it all the way, <laughs> or I he was half understand. asleep, or something. Uh, so, the, the limited edition cans are not exclusive to Walmart. Um, you can get them anywhere. But, if you buy two of the limited edition cans at Walmart, you can go to, it's just about the same uh, address that's on the can, uh, gears4.rockstarenergy.com, but you do a uh, forward slash, forward slash uh, Walmart. Enter your codes there and you get an exclusive uh, gear pack. It's the gear pack that is exclusive to Walmart, not the cans themselves. The When you see the display, it is a little bit um, easy to misunderstand yeah, unless you read the fine print. You have to read the fine print, <laughs> that's the thing. Um, <laughs> Because they have exclusive at Walmart, and then the cans, and then like in tiny print it says the rest of it. So. Yeah, so, I'm sorry, <laughs> I that fucked up, I fucked up, <laughs> I'm quick to admit it. Um, so, just want to clear that up. Um, if you hear a lot of jingling, Waffles is behind me attacking my hand. Yes. Um, <laughs> yeah, I want, to do the, I want to do this next, uh, since we're talking about... Uh, you know, gamers, gamer this shit. This whole thing is gamer stuff. Yeah, I know, but like, drinks and everything. So, so uh, anyways, Mountain Dew has their gamer fuel out. Uh, this time it is promoting Titanfall 2. You can get double X... Uh, X plus. Yeah. Exple. You can get <laughs> double XP plus exclusive Titan rewards. Of course, they have the uh, citrus cherry, the basic. I love that one. I'm excited for this I look next forward one. to it like every year. And we have a new we have a new one. Mango heat flavor. When I just glanced at that, it looked like it said meat. The age <laughs> looks like it says mango meat. So this is a new one. I love I'm, mango. I'm I'm kinda iffy about this one, but I do want to try it. I love mango, so I'm sure I'm going to love it. So either way, I'm excited for this one. And of course, under the cap is your code. You go to whatever the website is. That's Where most is it? Good. Oh, doingdoritos.com. So it's it's not it's not just the Mountain Dew. Uh, it's not just the gamer fuel that you can get the codes on. You can get it on regular Mountain Dew as well, and also uh, Doritos bags, uh, specially marked, of course. It smells good. Yeah, it does smell like a mango smell. Mm. It does smell good. So with Gamer Fuel, does it have energy in it? Because like I always misinterpret that as having some sort of energy. I know Mountain Dew has a lot of caffeine in it, anyways, doesn't it? Or is it just sugar? Or am I the only one that gets like a caffeinated like thing from Mountain Dew? No, I get it. I get if I haven't had Mountain Dew in a while. Do you like it? It was just like sour at the end. That was unexpected. Yeah, that it, is good. It, it's good. I do. Uh, I do like it. Uh, but if we get these, I think uh, they go Stop to her. Stop looking down! Zelda wanted to get up there and be bad. Zelda! Yeah. Shh, shh. Hey, little missy, get mm -hmm. down! Zelda, get down, baby. There's something up there for you. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Alright, so, gamer gamer chat, uh, this this is Zelda. This is my baby. <laughs> Say hi, guys! She, she, she's going to be a big girl. We got she her fixed, is. so she's getting fat. Yes, yeah, she is. Oh, she's purring. Aww. She purring. But um, she's this it, it's not like overpoweringly mango. Like mm -hmm. you know, some mango stuff is like thick and sickingly sweet. This is sweet, but it's not thick and it's not like sickingly sweet. It tastes. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. It, it's good. It's good. But like like I was saying, if we did get more of it, it. It would be hers. This is mine. Um, I love this. This is delicious. This is the one that I, I like. I need the lid. The one that they always put out. I always look forward to it. Like, every time they bring it out. Uh, I don't think you've had this one. How many shades does it take to put on a lid? <laughs> I 
I don't think so because I don't remember ever it's since so we've been living together we've always had a hard time finding the gamer fuel so because it's only out at certain times yeah but ooh that smells good that smells like Pop Rocks cherry mmm that is good yeah, I don't really like cherry very favorite. much I still prefer the mango yeah so um so yeah they do have the gamer fuel back out i was happy to see that um uh, promoting it came out like a few weeks ago that we first yeah, saw it so uh promoting titanfall 2 i don't know how long they'll be out for we found these at walmart i i honestly cannot wait to see the uh single player campaign for titanfall 2 uh that's gonna be like the biggest selling point for that game um I, on, honestly, honestly, I still need to play the first game. I'm not really big on uh, multiplayer games, especially multiplayer it's, only. This that mecha one? The mech, yeah. Yeah. I mean, the game looks fucking badass, but I just... Was it the first person one? Yeah, it's first Okay, person. that's why. I can't really handle playing first person without a dream, I mean. It makes me motion sick, so even watching some of the gamer uh, trailers, I can't, I can't really do. Yeah. So, so, it from what I did see, like you know, a little bit, it does Excuse look me. like a really cool game. Okay, so uh, third point. Everybody? Third point, yes. Okay, so third point. The main thing. The, of this the main. Video. The main thing for this video is. Da, 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 da. Legendary crate. It came number in two. Super number early. two. It came in. I'm actually surprised it came in because I did not get any tracking info. Yeah, there wasn't any information. They, they that didn't they send sent me it. anything. This is supposed to be November's box, and it's like August or October. It's October. <laughs> August. October. So. What's today? The twenty seventh. Dad's birthday was yesterday, right? The twenty sixth. Yeah. So today's the twenty seventh of October. So this is November's box. This is crazy. But they re they we got the other one early too. I don't so know. The other one was the only last, like a few days early. Wasn't I, I'm this pretty like sure really like early. like the last the last. Uh, Pretty much within the last week, we get of the uh, previous month, you know. But okay, the box looks the same, um, which is all right. Kind of mystery. Kind of upset that it got creased there, but yeah. Ooh, this does have a new inside, though. I will turn this around. Here, I'll so hold this so you can like. Poor Zelda. There, like lift up the lid. So you can see the, the inside. new inside. And this is what it looks like on the, like this is what you first see when you open yes. it. Yes. That so is that, so cool. That is cool. The outside looks the same, but the inside. Here, I'll, I'll hold this right here for you. Like this. So you All right, just... Zelda, you gotta move, <laughs> baby. I'm sorry. Sorry, baby. All right, so uh, first thing. Ooh, I see stuff. First thing, the uh, top secret envelope. We give you guys clearance to view this video. <laughs> We got a, uh... Ooh! Oh, this is my one-year subscription bonus. This did not... This was supposed to be in my first box. Uh, so the other... The pin that I got in the first box was not the one-year subscription bonus. That was, was... That was the pin that was supposed to be with the box. I was... I was, uh, confused on that one. That I... Misunderstood. I, yeah, I honestly thought that it was... But this... It actually says one year subscription bonus. I mean, okay. <laughs> with with this being my very first subscription box, yeah, you know, I I was a little confused. Especially this is like it's not only like really the first subscription box he's either of us have really done, but um, it's also our first things with Loot Crate. Yes, which I love so far the stuff from Loot Crate, and I want to get like some of the like. But thing, uh, so. here is the one year subscription bonus. That is so cool. It, it is a from... very nice pen. I like it. It kind of looks like hockey pucks. Kind it's of. the <laughs> uh, it's the legendary symbol. Mm -hmm. When when you when you choose legendary difficulty, that's the oh okay yeah okay. So I see this. I wanna <laughs> I gotta wanna show this. <laughs> What is that? Uh, okay, first, for, this is the new figure. Um, he kind of looks like a chibi. I will tell you that I did not know what the figure was. They did release, like, info about it, like, what it was and everything. But I did not look. 
I wanted it to be a surprise. Uh, I, I honestly I don't know what the theme is for this box. When I find out, I will let you know. It sh that should be right here. Yeah. But, oh no no wait wait no 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 no. no. That's a rec pack. Okay. Okay. Well, the code's on this side. So okay, since we already pulled this out, Halo Five rec pack. Is that the theme or is that? So that's uh, in-game content. Oh, okay. It's a it's a rec pack in-game content for the. What we like doing with these is um, being as like surprised, like when we open it and show it to you. That's the first thing we see. Yeah. So uh, we'll we'll look for that later. So, anyways, I wanted I wanted it to be a surprise. Uh, so in here. In the last one, didn't they put the info about the stuff in the envelope? I'll I'll look for it in a sec. I'm just. Um, so here is the new figure. This is the second figure. It is Buck. It looks like a chibi. Cause like his head is big, his it, little it, body. It's uh, the ODST version. I'll show you the back of it. ODST Buck figure. That is awesome. Um, I'm gonna open this and put it together so you can see what it looks like. Real quick. Uh, So like when we pull it out of the box and show it to you guys, it's like our first reactions to it. That's what I meant to say. I got to. There play. you go. <laughs> pull this out. You know, uh, ODST was my favorite. Was my favorite. Halo but it doesn't game. look like you have to put it together. Yeah, you do. Oh, do you? Yeah, it's still a separate base. You get the the base. And they uh, put base. it in there pretty well. Like you yeah, can show they that. they actually strapped him into the <laughs> plastic there. So, very well. So there's like no chance of him like falling out and getting damaged. Yeah, unless they unless they put the twist tie on loosely, but which they didn't. Yeah, but even then there wasn't very much room to yeah. maneuver around in the box if he got loose. But here is the figure. <laughs> that is so cool. And this one isn't very customizable. As it is only one character, there's only one way to put him in. But again, it is a tight fit. Oh, it clicked. Yeah, but that could have been the bottom of the base. It sounded like it clicked into place. So, this is how it looks. That is All put cool. together. And, I believe... Yes. Uh, show you on the. Here, I'll hold him. No. Okay. Over here. Show you on this, on the side of the box here. This one right here. I'm not sure if you can read it, but it says collect and connect. So this will connect to the one that we got in the first box, as well as the new ones that we get in boxes three, four, and so on. So that is awesome. Throw this stuff back into the box here. I really like these boxes. Alright. So, um. Do that one, it's on top. This one? Yeah. Yeah, I did see these first. Okay, yeah. This is the only thing that I knew was coming because they asked for a size, for sizing. Oh, those are so nice. Pants, sleep oh. pants. Okay, so. I'm gonna have Those are long. <laughs> yeah. Have it folded over. Okay, so as you can see, it is the ODST Feet First into Hell. And that is I so love these. awesome. I love these. Those especially, are nice. especially since ODST was my favorite game. I mean, uh, don't get me wrong, I love Master Chief, he is fucking awesome. <laughs> uh, he, he's he's a to like seriously he's a he's a fucking beast. I, I love Master Chief, he's awesome. But the way that they did ODST was just really awesome. The mystery and everything. It kept you engaged. Exactly. Exactly. It kept <laughs> you engaged. Alright, so I, I, I have a feeling that... Uh, I see these, so I'm going to show these <laughs> next. I kind of have a feeling that this is a ODST themed box. <laughs> Which makes him a happy boy. 
So uh, we've got another pin, Battle for Earth. That's pretty. Um, yes. It looks like that's, a... Uh, that's an interesting... It looks like, um, like you know, when you're head, head on to a... It kind of looks like a shield. Actually, it kind of looks like one of the uh, medals you get in multiplayer. Oh. Like, oh. like for like a killing spree or oh, something possibly. like that. Yeah. One of the achievement thingies. Oh, it, it'd be like an in-game spree medal. I call them like in-game achievements. So. Uh, we got. But it kind of like with the glare from the light. Yeah. It kind of looked like from like you're straight on being laser blasted at. Okay, and <laughs> we got this. What is that? I don't know. I'll I'm gonna open it up. <laughs> It doesn't look happy. Oh, there, <laughs> there it goes. There, there, go. there it's, it's happy. happy. And now it's angry. <laughs> <laughs> or annoyed. Or sleepy. No, it's like, I'm so done with your shit right okay, now. Okay, <laughs> so so obviously this, I, I recognize this. I can't exactly remember which way it goes. Probably this way. <laughs> no, wait, wait, wait. It goes like that. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this was from, from the game, the uh, health stations. open this and figure out what this is <laughs> before we actually look and see what it is. Okay. Reduction. And it's uh, Velcro. So might might be like a patch thing. Yeah, like like a Velcro patch. That's interesting. Very good Velcro. Oh. And uh, these are rubber. The actual things are rubber. I really like the ODST one. I do. I like this ODST one. And he's like, what? I'm not good enough for you? <laughs> no, look at that face. Look at the face you put on him. So, uh... I just want to boop you with this. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Okay, so... Here's the t-shirt. Here is the t-shirt. Boom. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I gotta look at that. I gotta look at that. <laughs> gotta look at that. <laughs> yeah. Up. Or orbital, orbital drop. drop shock trooper feet, feet, feet first, first into hell it matches the pants do you have a jammy set yes i do that what is what awesome. i like about those is like the I'm material is this this weekend. the material is like <laughs> nice and it'll keep you warm but not th wanna, too thick to where it's you want to show the inside of the box since we emptied it out there's the there is a glare but uh Whoa. we also got a tube a to tube. bash each other with. <laughs> no, they, we no have, wait, see, see, look. Wait. <laughs> we have waffles. Here's your box. Hey, waffles does not get no, to clear that box. No, he's right. He's right behind my butt. What is that? Oh, it's a poster. Poster, posters, something like that. Get Some it out. sort of orbital paper. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, like, and on the back of this it says uh, what we got. So <laughs> that's what it was. It was on the back of the poster last time, remember? Wasn't it? It was on the no. back of something. It, we had a little uh, booklet in the last one. Okay, was it the booklet? So here, I'll can you this side. Yeah, hold, hold that side. I want to look at it real quick, baby. Oh, that is pretty. I like that. We might have to put this one up. Okay, so. Oh look, they have a little thing right here. Ultimate Edition Halo pre-order. Okay, this crates loadout. Battle for Earth. And that's the theme. Battle for Earth. Uh, let's see, 2552. The Alien Covenant has burned a hundred worlds to ensure humanity's destruction. Only Earth remains. And the Covenant have discovered its location. Humanity must fight back or face extinction and the brave heroes of the orbital drop shock troopers drop are shock troopers. are That's at the saying. front lines the battle for earth starts now drop shock troopers that, <laughs> <laughs> say right, that so, times fast. start from like up here and then so of course we got the halo 5 guardians wreck pack um, the gift that keeps on giving. Redeem the code on the card to get access to exclusive in-game content. Can you hold the, yes. the sign? I tried okay. to do that earlier, but no, you had to take it. And then uh, our this pin, it's the stick it. 
metal pin. Like a, that's what I was saying. It looked like one of the medals. It's the stick it. Oh. Nice work. You're being awarded this medal for successfully sticking a plasma grenade to an enemy <laughs> combatant and making them explode. An elite few will get a rare gold variant. We didn't get the gold variant, unfortunately. I really wish we would have. But, but I kind of like this variant better because th this this is the normal version, and then they do have a rare gold variant. Which right there, you can see the yeah. gold and then the normal. I like the normal better, to be honest, because it shows the detail I, more. Yeah, but you want the rare because it's rare. Because it's rare. So yeah, I would have I would have much rather had that rare one, with with my love for uh, gaming and collectibles. <laughs> well, not only that, but also Halo. Yeah. I mean, that's the whole reason that I subscribed to a full year of this box. Um, I would have loved to have had that, just because it's rare. Uh, okay, uh, the ODST t-shirt. ODST t-shirt. <laughs> the ODST may be green and very, very mean, but this shirt, adorned with the Orbital Drop Shock Trooper emblem, is black, so you look stylish on the attack. You're rhyming again. <laughs> black is the new black, as we say in the Marines. The ODST hell pants. <laughs> feet first into brunch. <laughs> After a long day of punching aliens in the face, hard charging ODSTs like to kick back and read battle damage assessments in comfortable, stylish, and oh so tactical lounge pants. Okay, when it says feet first into brunch. Like, I first started the new Jack in the Box commercials, and then I was oh, like... Oh, yeah. I was like, if if Jack's wife, like, saw you putting your feet in her scrambled eggs and potatoes, you're <laughs> dead. Okay, you're dead. Okay. She's going to stick it to you. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to skip this one right now, because we haven't really gotten to that. Okay, the Halo Icons Buck, uh, ODST Buck figure. <laughs> Check your mouths, find your chairs, and get set for an epic figure drop. ODST Gunnery Sergeant Edward Buck is ready to dance with the Covenant Invasion Force, but first he needs to be unleashed from this Halo legendary crate. Already a Halo veteran, bring the battle for Earth to the next level by collecting and connecting the other Halo Icons figures. And the Halo morale patches... That's right. <laughs> they, are, they are patches. They're morale patches. That one doesn't seem very happy to be. It's dangerous to go alone and unadorned <laughs> on the battlefield. Don't say we never gave you anything as you flaunt uniform regulations with an ODST emblem and a wink at the new Mombasa cameras with a superintendent emblem. And here's a little bonus intel. These Velcro-backed patches are perfect for attaching to the utility satchel from crate, crate one. one. Nice. nice. Okay, so the one that we didn't, the one that we skipped because we didn't get to it, we haven't opened it yet, is the UNSC data drop. It says, uh, get your hands on classified documents that gave the UNSC the intel they needed to strike back during the battle for Earth, including satellite images of the Forerunner portal unearthed, unearthed near New Mombasa. Mm -hmm. Alright, so... Mombasa sounds like um, a lion from the Lion King. <laughs> it sounds like it could be Mufasa's son. I love how they do these envelopes, these data drops. Mombasa. I love saying that. Ooh. I want to see. Yes, I'm sure everyone wants to see. I want to see first. <laughs> Wom uh, it's here. F99 Wombat Recon Images. This is classified information. It's kind of glary. Yeah, it is. It's a, it's a glossy finish, but those yeah, are the satellite like images that they were talking about. That is cool, though. Look at, look at that baby. That's cool. There you go, you can see it a 
and then uh, the rest of this is uh, more to the story of the crate. Uh, I have not read the stuff from the first crate, so I... Uh, Didn't you say you were kind of waiting for multiple crates to kind of get the story all at once? Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of waiting a little bit, but I am, like, really anxious to read this stuff. But it's uh, all uh, classification, Oni eyes only, and, you know, I really love these little data drop packs that they do. <laughs> Be smarter than the string, honey. <laughs> Hi, Waffles. Where'd he go? He moved. Where'd he go? You, oh, you lose your still... waffles? <laughs> I lost my waffles. He went over and stole my pillow. Okay, uh... Yes. Give me the poster so I don't get damaged. So what do you think of the box? I like it. Um, on a note, um... If you did not subscribe to the Halo Loot Crate and you are interested, uh, you can go to Loot Crate and uh, order. And if you were wanting the previous crate, you're wanting Crate 1, if you liked the uh, contents that were in there and you want the first crate, you can go to. Um, oh, what was it? It was. Uh, the Loot Crate Vault. Uh, they should have a link on the Loot Crate. Ugh, god damn. <laughs> on the Loot See, Crate. While we were out, you kept teasing me about, like, tumbling over my words, and now he's doing it, so ha. Ah. But they should have a link to the vault uh, through the Loot Crate website, and they have the first uh, legendary crate in the vault for purchase. Is it still available for purchase the last time you looked? The last time I looked, which was yesterday, it is still available. Um, and I am sure uh, if you haven't gotten the second box either, I'm sure that the second box will go into the, the vault. Just so, a thing, like, if you guys want it. <laughs> just in case you guys want it, you know, maybe you, you uh, missed a box or something, keep an eye on the vault. You can get past... Uh, do they have um, other past crates? Yes, they do. They have other past crates, but uh, as well as like individual items from cr from the crates and everything that you can get from the vault. But I'm sure it's limited. It is limited. Like very um, limited. What are we looking for? I don't remember. <laughs> Overall, what do you think of the crate? Did you like it? I liked it. I liked it. I, I was I was really hoping to get it this weekend because I wanted my he pants. Wanted the pants. I wanted my pants. I knew that I was getting some pants because of the the sizing info and everything. So oh, I remember uh, all of these items, all the items that come in the legendary crate are exclusive. You're not gonna find them anywhere else. Unless someone gets the crate and tries to sell. Yes, but. <laughs> But then it's like tr like tremendously marked up, you know, like yeah. expensive. Crate so, crate. yeah, these are all exclusive to the crate. Um, we gotta start wrapping up. We're getting to yeah. <laughs> I I did want to say that. Uh, Don't let me. You didn't tell what? me what you want to say. <laughs> Oh, they, they're so getting cool. ready to release info about the uh, uh, November's Mega Crate. And from the picture that they showed, it, it looks like it has a, some stuff from the Assassin's Creed movie, which comes out in December. That movie looks awesome. Honestly, it looks awesome. I can't wait. I want to see it. Um, we got to go give Dad I, his birthday present. I really... I. I honestly want Loot Crate and Ubisoft to work together and make an Assassin's Creed crate. That would be amazing. Even if even if it's just a one-shot special edition crate. We would get it. <laughs> I would get it, definitely. If it was a you know, year subscription, if it was you know, an actual subscription box, I'd still get it. Yeah. I love Assassin's Creed probably just as much as Halo. They, I would love if they did a year-long subscription crate for Gears. That, that would, would be amazing. That would be fun. That would be fun. That would be so cool. 
Yes. Um, we're hitting but, almost 30 minutes. And yeah, it cuts but off. So. We we do need to wrap it up. So, um, all in all, this was a great, uh, very great trait. <laughs> You're right here. Yes, I am. <laughs> <laughs> um. I will leave a link down below if, like, for Loot Crate, and I'll try to find the link crate. and the vaults um, and everything. So if anyone is interested, um, I will leave links down below so you can check out everything. They have yes. multiple crates. They have multiple, multiple different... Multiple crates, yes. Yeah, like ones for gr girls and stuff like that. So um, it is, like, a great uh, gamer gift if, like, we geek highly gift. recommend. Yeah, it, it's more than, more than gaming. It, yeah. It's geek. They, they have Marvel. They have DC... It's they even uh, have Doctor like, Who, Star Trek, Star yeah, Wars. Yeah, they have like a fandom one, I think, for like girls that have dresses and stuff in yeah, them, so, which I want to check out. I'm, I, I want to get into that. But we gotta, we gotta wrap this yeah. up. Um, thank, thank you for you, watching. Thank you for watching. 